you know that there's two billion kids in the world? Can you think of anything else that there's two billion of? Um, two billion stockings. Wouldn't there be four billion stockings? Do you not have one stocking for each foot, or do you only put one stocking up? I put three stockings. Well, that three. seems Maybe cheap. like. I put five stockings. How do you think Santa figures out how to get presents to all of those two billion kids? He could get a college degree. <laughs> oh. Good. Oh. Did you just have a business idea there? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so how do you choose which is the first place to go to? I have an idea. What? Yeah. The one that's closest to his house will maybe go to first. Oh, which place would that be? I don't know, maybe South Carolina? <laughs> oh, South Carolina maybe? Yeah. Close to the North Pole. So what's a place outside of the United States? You Canada, might know. Um, Canada. Can Mexico, Russia, Australia, China, the United States. So how does he get it done so quickly, going from place to place? He can stop time. The reindeer can fly. How fast do they fly, you think? Like how many miles an hour? 200 miles an hour. Dude, what do you think? Um, 500 miles an hour. 500. 100. What do you think, Lila? How fast does a reindeer go? Do you think there's anything you could do to improve Santa's efficiency? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> what about when Santa gets to the house? How does he get into the house? The chimney. The chimney? Does he squeeze down little or... Does he make the chimney big? Big. Okay. Does that cause any structural issues for the house? I don't know. I don't either. <laughs> In a movie, it shows his hat makes him like turn into like some kind of dust and then go through the chimney and then turn back into Santa and then deliver this point. So what if he comes down the chimney? And there's a fire in the chimney. He can stop the fire. Oh, he stops the fire. Yeah, because he's magic. No one would be having a fire when they're asleep. Yeah, you gotta think about that. I do not have a chimney. Oh, well, how does he get into your house? Uh, we leave him with one of my door keys. Well, that's nice of you. You said that Santa comes in through the door. Does he need a key for your door? No. Do you just leave it unlocked? Do any of the neighbors come over and borrow your milk when you're not home? Something at college, and I was Santa. I would study Jingle Bells.